name is uh, SCJ Aguele. Uh, I am the CEO for Verify Me Nigeria. Uh, we've had very interesting presentations today, and we're really very excited to be here. Uh, Verify Me is an ID verification and work history reporting company. Essentially, we're a KYC company. And what we do is we create, and we're creating trusted and secure digital identities for the Nigeria and the African market. The mobility business in, um, in Africa and of course in Nigeria is really growing very quickly. Uh, as I've listened to uh, a lot of companies come here who have really very innovative solutions, uh, one of the, I would say, uh, recurring questions that they get is about security. How do you provide uh, better security for the, your passengers and how do you provide uh, better security for your drivers? When we were coming here, we looked at the list of organizations that were uh, attending this event, and we're actually quite happy to say that many organizations, uh, the startups uh, here, um, I would mention, but uh, actually our customers. Uh, we have not announced, but uh, there are people that are taking security uh, very seriously. Many of the mobility companies here we are actually partnering with, the big ones and some of the small ones as well. Um, and I will talk to you a little bit about what we do. Um, so, like I said, really, it's, it's basically about digitizing trust, right, in terms of KYC. Uh, when you think about knowing somebody, uh, whether you're a bank or whether you're an employer or whether you're a mobility rideshare company that needs quick information, um, being able to get trusted information about an individual is very important. Today, Verify Me Nigeria leverages uh, National Identity, uh, which is the um, NIMSI National Identity Management Commission uh, repository. And we also leverage uh, BVN repository, and we're a, an official agent of the Nigerian Identity Management Commission. We have also signed uh, an MOU with FRSC to, for driver's license verification, and this is to all our uh, mobility uh, rideshare companies. And we're going to be one of the first companies in the next um, couple of weeks that will be bringing you um, FRSC driver's license verification as well. Um, one of the reasons we want to do this is because for some com compliance reasons, our customers sometimes have to identify um, their driving partners uh, before they can put them on the road. So we want to be able to provide at least the, the basic uh, anti-money laundering or CBN tier compliant legal identity. We want to help our customers uh, reduce fraud. Uh, we want to improve security in our you know, ecosystem and our community. Um, and we want to also help our employer organizations reduce their human capital risk. Um, so as we mentioned before, digitizing Africa's identity um, um, data for secure online delivery and also to enable growth for our customers. Um, in order to do this, really, KYC is a service, right, of uh, different data points that gives you trusted information. So the first level of our um, verification is actually the identity verification piece of it. And we layer address verification, guarantor verification, employment verification, credit, uh, credential verification um, for our customers. And we find many of our customers use different, I would say, um, combinations of these verification services to meet either their um, uh, business risk level or their compliance level. Most of our driving partners that use our business actually do the um, ID verification and in some cases um, address verification uh, is the product that they use mostly. Uh, very great features that we're actually um, looking to bring uh, to our uh, customers as well. Uh, right now we do have the capability for um, fingerprint biometric verification for any customers. Um, and we're looking to bring more biometric capabilities as well, such as facial recognition to these customers. Um, just through here, there are a few steps. Um, most of our solutions you can do in three easy steps. Um, we have an app. You can go to verifyme.ng. One of the great things we've done, actually, is we've uh, um, provided our solution so it's, it's uh, available for domestic and corporate users. So even if you're hiring a nanny or a driver or anyone, you can literally go to verifyme.ng um, and check somebody's identity real time. And you can actually request additional KYC um, data, which you get uh, in major cities in about 24 hours. And one of the good things is if we have digital identity, such, like an, uh, such as an address on that person, you actually get it real time as well in about 30 seconds, um, which we we'll would love to show you. Um, another great feature, and this is something that's not uh, provided on the last one, is our entire report is, is almost like a credit report you get in most countries. It's everything in one report, so the identity, guarantor, address is all available to you, um, downloadable in a PDF, and you can actually get all this information uh, which we have 
um, all of our services are also available over API. Um, so we also have a lot of KYC customers or banks who use us and use our ID verification services uh, over API as well, so they can increase their throughput um, and service their customers. So having said that, um, we are a managed verification platform. Um, I think most of the people here would be our customers at some point, and we're definitely looking forward to have you on board. It's really easy to plug into our KYC marketplace, um, and uh, I'll be happy to answer any questions that you have. Thank you. So the first one is actually a very good question in terms of us being targeted. Um, and we're very uh, aware of this. So the first thing I would say about it is we are um, ISO, ISMS compliant. Uh, we take cybersecurity very seriously. Um, we are also compliant with Nigerian uh, data laws, meaning all our data is hosted locally in Nigeria. Um, and you're right, you know, cybersecurity is very uh, important to us. And, you know, as a result, we actually uh, work and invest a lot in our um, security, really both logical and physical security infrastructure. Um, next question. That's another very good question. We are going to be, right now, there's no true mature criminal reporting data in Nigeria. Um, we will be one of the first organizations that um, will bring that to you. Um, Verify Me, we participate in the overall Nigeria e-governance -gov, uh, e um, implementation and, and advise on that. Um, I do know that criminal history reporting is coming up, um, and I believe in the next year um, this service is actually going to be available as well. That's another very interesting question. How do you onboard somebody from a rural area with no um, ID? You know, the way we look at it is between FRSC, NIN, and BVN, there are probably about 60 million Nigerians that have been documented. So that's living about 140 million. There is a big enough market that we can have a very robust, um, you know, ID verification and KYC uh, commercial uh, experience. Uh, however, Verify Me Nigeria is also, like I said earlier, we're licensed with NIMSI. Um, we are actually in the enrollment space and are working with the Nigerian Identity Management Commission so that you don't have to go to the government um, to get your NIN. You actually can come to locations at Verify Me, and of course they're outsourcing, or they're doing this with other organizations as well, so that we will be one of the organizations where you will be able to get your NIN. So to answer that question, if anyone who wants to be included in this digital ID um, ecosystem where they can get on-demand services. And by the way, just want to say this, it is important for people to be documented because citizens as well want to be able to get on-demand insurance services. You want to be able to open a bank account without having to go to the bank. You know, what we do with our digital KYC marketplace is we actually just enable people to be able to get a lot of services instantly and remotely as well. Um, so to answer that question is we're actually in the documentation space as well, um, where we can actually help you get documented in Nigeria to receive your NIN so that you can actually uh, be onboarded and people can check your history. Um, and that will be the last question that we have time for, I believe. Um, so thank you very much, and I look forward to talking to everyone. I'll be here for a while. Thank you. Uh, this is uh, Tochuku from our team, and he'll be talking to you guys briefly about uh, the, um, the app that we have that we want to show you. Hi, everyone. Um, Tochiku Achebe from Verify Me. Oh, hi everyone. So this is our product. This is um, your sign up page. This is how it works. Um, this is basically the dashboard. Like CJ also said, um, you have the bundles, which we've basically incorporated due to, uh, based on the re amount of requests that we get, the request for employees, loan applicants and workers. And you can also basically choose your own verification as well. Um, next slide. Okay, so this is basically your um, ID form. It has your first name, last name. It can you can literally um, I, you can literally authenticate anyone using any ID type like um, your NIN or your BVN, essentially. Okay, this is the this is what the report page looks like. Uh, this is the CJ. Uh, yeah, he looks nice, isn't it? Yeah. So uh, this is the CJ. Uh, this is his ID pulled up from Nin. Um, this is the address verification. So essentially, we're saying we have this pictures of his, basically his house, uh, and then we have GPS coordinates from his house. This is how how the address report looks like. 
uh, his guarantor. Uh, basically, his guarantor also gets the mail. That's how the, um, the process works. And then his employment verification as well. So really, you just need to, uh, yeah. So really, you just need to log on to verifyme.ng. And the process is really seamless. We've made it very, very seamless for you to get on it. Um, you ask the question, yes, you have to pay for this, but we've made it very cheap for you. Really, really cheap. ID verification is actually 500 naira. Do you believe that? Yeah, we actually made it that cheap. 